But <laughs> my final remarks is going to be about the Super Bowl. Um, I already talked about Brock Purdy, how he played amazing. But I'm going to go back to the Usher concert. Um, that is entirely too long. Rudy already touched on it. And being somebody who, who tore his Achilles because, I, don't, I mean, it probably is going to go anyway, but my offense had the ball for 12 minutes, 10 minutes on the drive, and then we went back out there on the second play. I just popped it. So to see Greenlaw go out there and just, you know, after a long time just sitting down like that and just trying to get hyped to get back out there on the field, his his Achilles just to go in the biggest moment of his career trying to win a championship, it was sad to see, man. I just wish, I, I, I know it's a spectacle that day, but we have to take care of our players. We have to look out for them. It's it's a big moment. It's important for them also. But like Rudy said, maybe, you know, we break down the halftime show to the beginning, you know, and maybe a little bit later. But we, we can't have players waiting 45 minutes to play a game. They played. They got all their adrenaline popping. And they're going to tell them to sit down. They're going to say, keep warm. Keep warm. Bitch, how? Bitch, how? I can't. I'm trying my best, and now you want me to go back out there and go full speed at a level that I probably didn't play at most of the season because this is the most important game of the season. And now you want me to go back full speed after I sat for a damn near an hour? Come on, man. We're asking for it, man. Protect these players. I love the Usher concert, but come on, NFL. We got to do better. We got to find a way to engage our fans, but take care of our players. That's what I got to say. 